What's up, guys? My name is uh, Julian Prince, and I run the SXM Festival um, in uh, beautiful St. Martin, in the Caribbean. The festival started in 2016. Well, it actually started in January 2015 when I decided to uh, take it over and to uh, produce it. It took about 15 months before the first edition. And what inspired it was it was a project that I had in mind for a very long time, being in the industry, did pretty much everything <laughs> from uh, working in clubs and managing them to uh, DJing and producing and uh, doing a lot of events as well. So uh, it just felt like a natural evolution of, uh, of, 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 of you know, what I could gather in, in terms of skills. Uh, it includes travels, hotels. Uh, food and beverage, and these were all things that I was very, very comfortable with. So built a team and built the dream and had a beautiful party on the beach uh, the following March. So the festival happens in St. Martin in the Caribbean, tiny little island divided in two countries, Dutch and French. Uh, so it's basically like a little Ca European Caribbean island next to the islands of St. Bart's and Anguilla. They're very famous islands as well. So it's a nice ar archipel of paradise. <laughs> the kind of music we play goes from house to techno. We had uh, Richie Houghton, uh, Jamie Jones, uh, you know, as well as Bedouin and Sabo and that kind of music. We've had as well um, Jamie, uh, yeah, we, I said Jamie, um, Lee Burridge and, uh, <clears throat> you know, that sort of what a dreamy kind of house to a bit more intense with like Marco Carolla and Loco Dice and, 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 and all these guys. So all of our, all of our favorite DJs uh, and aspiring DJs as well, like, you know, Gab Rome, Cora and uh, <clears throat> an emergent artist from basically everywhere in the world. Um, you know, RPR was uh, was there as well, so guys from Romania. So every year, you know, we, <clears throat> according to the schedule, get to uh, get our hands on on on, uh, on some cool music, and then we build a lineup from uh, from it. The first act we ever booked was Jamie Jones. Uh, we figured that if Jamie wanted to come, the rest would follow, and that year was tremendous. We did uh, uh, the first year we had. Uh, um, Maceo Plex, uh, Jamie Jones, uh, Lee Burridge, a Bedouin, Blondish, uh, and yeah, and a bunch of amazing artists. Uh, so yeah, the first year was fantastic. And thank you, Jamie, for that. There, there's been actually too many mem memorable sets, uh, you know, from uh, sunrise to sunset, the festival runs, so, you know, different part of the day, but uh, I mean, I, I don't want to attribute to anyone the best set because there, there were too many uh, over the years. Uh, so, yeah, uh, <laughs> I don't want to answer that. The festival is, uh, is, is, is mostly people from the United States, Canada, and Mexico, so North America. A lot of people from the surrounding islands, uh, Guadeloupe, Martinique, St. Martin, uh, uh, St. Barts, etc. Our, um, our festival attendee uh, is around 34 years old in average. Uh, we do have about 5% of the festival, 5 to 8% of people between 18 and 25, and 15% over 40, so it's 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 a it's a bit of an older demographic, but um, yeah, I mean everyone's welcome. <laughs> Well, I think that, you know, a lot of the festivals in the world don't really happen uh, outdoors 100% and that you can dance with your feet in the sand. Uh, so uh, our, our, our main grounds is in Happy Bay. It's 16 acres of jungle and waterfront of uh, about, I would say, 800 uh, meters on the beach. So it's, it's very crazy that, you know, we can just be there all night and, and dance uh, outdoors. Everything's handmade. Uh, we have about 30 uh, artists, local and 
international artists that uh, that um, specialize in upcycling. So there's a lot of art, uh, interactive sculptures, and you know uh, everything is made by hands. You know the sign the signage, the menus, everything. So I feel it's very intimate. Uh, it's about a 5,000 people festival, and uh, it really has the the intimacy vibes. Uh, so yeah, you really feel that you're close to everything and the artist. And most of the artists spend the week there as a vacation, so people get to you know. Uh, you know, cross everyone at the restaurants or in the shuttles, or it's it's really like get, get that get that get that vibes of everyone you know becomes friends. So it, it, it's 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 a beautiful uh, experience, and we're really proud to be uh, able to enable uh, those uh, human connectivities. <laughs> I, I want to. I want to wish everyone right now. We're going through the most difficult period uh, in the history of of, of events. Um, uh, good luck uh, to everyone, and a lot of. We need strength. We need creativity to get out of it, and hopefully, this will all be something we can. We will be able to forget and to get back to uh, to doing what we love doing, is bringing people together and enjoying their life. <laughs>